Hello, my name is Dan Nanto, and I'm the Assistant Director for our, the Infrastructure Development Team here at ITS at Vanderbilt University. We're here today to talk a little bit about the ITS Web 2.0 contest and to announce the winners of that contest. To give you a little bit of background about the contest, we announced it last summer, and we opened it up to all students here at Vanderbilt University. Uh, the goal of the contest was to encourage students to use new technologies and also to contribute to the Vanderbilt uh, community. Judging was done uh, based on three different criteria. Uh, the judging was based on the potential contribution to the Vanderbilt community of the uh, entry, also its creativity, and its use of Web 2.0 technologies. Um, so to announce these, uh, the three winners that we have for our contest, uh, the, first prize, or the third prize goes to a gentleman by the name of Zhang Fu. Uh, he will receive an Apple iPod, and he submitted a, uh, a Chinese website, which will help those who speak Chinese here at the Vanderbilt community. Um, the second prize goes to Matt Huckabee. He'll receive a $500 check. And that uh, award for, is for his entry of an implementation of Google Maps that shows the Vanderbilt community and the Vanderbilt uh, uh, campus map with Google Map integration. Uh, finally, the grand prize winner is, uh, goes to Aaron Thompson, who's joined us here today. Uh, he will receive a $1,000 uh, grand prize. And so first off, Aaron, thank you for joining us here today. Thanks, Dan. And he's going to tell us a little bit about his, um, his application. OK. Well, when I saw this contest announced uh, this summer, I thought, well, $1,000, that's, uh, that's worth some time. So I thought a little about it, about what website I could have used at campus. And uh, I figured I spent, I, uh, I ate a lot of meals from the convenience stores on campus, which we call the Munchie Mart. Uh, but sometimes I'd want to try something, but it seemed a little risky. So, so I wouldn't try it. Or then other times, I'd try something and be great, and I'd I figure I might let other people know. So from that, I came up with the idea for the Munchie Mart Review. And this is the site here. You can see that we have uh, some recent ratings that people have given. And you can also see the different categories to the side. And this is all uh, perfect XHTML 1.0 uh, legal code and everything, so it's very cross-platform and uh, standards compliant. So we can browse the different reviews here, uh, look at frozen entrees, and I'm looking at hmm, corner, corner Bistro Paninis. These sound good, so I'll look at that and I'll see what other people thought of this. And so that looks good. Maybe I'll, I'll give it a try. So I try it, I rate it, Mm, I didn't like it as much as everyone else. So I'll enter my rating there and, and a little bit of a comment if I want. And submit the rating. And it processes. And it ends up right there at the bottom, which is using AJAX, which is a Web 2.0 technology. And then. Another way to rate the food is through this form here. You can select the category. And then notice that when you select the category, it populates this menu item here with the different things that are in that category for easy rating. And, or you could also rate your own thing. So let's see. I'll rate hmm, the, the, cupcake that the cupcakes that they have at the Common Grounds. So this item, call it cup, cup, I can't type, cupcake from common grounds. And I'll give it an A because it is soft, delicious, and moist. Submit that. And then if we look below here at desserts, you'll see it showed up right there. And you can also search here for grounds. And you'll see that there's both the, those two things from that. And that's my entry. So what did your friends think of this, uh, of your application when you showed them? My friends uh, laughed a little at first, but then they realized that it was, they, uh, they thought it was pretty great. 
Well, uh, Aaron, thank you very much for coming in today uh, and meeting with us. Uh, we'd like to thank everybody who uh, participated in the contest. Um, we feel like it was a great success, and we look forward to doing something like this in the future. And uh, again, thank you, Aaron, for coming in. Thanks.